I'm Mike Tolliver. Lots of great news comes across our desk here at ICOC Hot News. And today we're taking you across North America, stopping in four of our ICOC congregations. We begin in Columbia, Missouri. Some good news from a church of just about 100 disciples. Uh, our church in uh, Columbia, Missouri has sent out in the last few months two church leaders. Jason Touche is going to Oklahoma City. Janice Abelio is going to go lead the church in Springfield, Missouri. In addition to that, our church has been able to hire eight campus interns and prayerfully be able to raise up more church leaders all to God's glory. In Texas and in Oklahoma, we had an incredible year as we started our first ministry and training program. We have over 160 disciples from all over the region come together in Austin, Texas to have a week of teaching and training. We got taught how to preach, how to teach, how to share our faith and study the Bible with our friends. And that week, that's exactly what we did. We spent the day in the classroom, but in the evenings we had workshops as we went out to the University of Texas at Austin to share our faith with students and invite them to a Bible talk. We had many friends come out, and since then we've had four students that have been studying the Bible seriously, and one has already been baptized. And we're looking forward to next year as we see more friends and hopefully more future brothers and sisters be impacted from all over around Texas and Oklahoma. Mi nombre es Victor Hugo Nava, mi esposa Sandra. Queremos eh, compartirles grandes noticias de la ciudad, de la iglesia de la Ciudad de México. Somos alrededor de 3,800 discípulos. Al inicio de este año tuvimos también una reunión de liderazgo en la iglesia del Distrito Federal en donde participaron más de 400 líderes. Tuvimos nuestra contribución especial también en este año, que fue increíble. Tuvimos más de 20 veces nuestro presupuesto semanal para esta contribución y estamos muy agradecidos con eso. Esperamos que Dios siga bendiciendo este ministerio de una manera muy especial. Our final story takes us to Tegucigalpa in Honduras. In the 1990s, Isaac and Olga Bonilla decided to serve their community by taking care of a few orphaned children. Their love for the children moved them to help start an orphanage. And in 2011, Isaac became our brother in Christ. We interviewed him at the orphanage and asked him why he's so passionate about helping the children. Todas ellas están en etapa escolar y están desde primer grado hasta el primer año en la universidad. Mi mayor deseo para, para estos niños o jóvenes ahora dentro del hogar es que ellos puedan llegar a ser discípulos del Señor, eh, integrarse en una familia o ser profesionales. Lo que me motivó a realizar este trabajo social ha sido mi convicción en la Palabra de Dios, donde Él nos manda eh, que tenemos que ayudar a los huérfanos y a los abandonados. Y ese es un principio que yo lo tengo que aplicar. No me dice si tengo la, la parte económica o la capacidad, sino que como discípulo obediente lo debo de realizar. Whether in Missouri, Texas, Mexico City, or Honduras, God is at work in our churches to reach the lost, raise up leaders, and help the poor. Be praying for these and all of our churches as we press forward in service to Him. And come join us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram. That's all for now. God bless. <laughs>